Hey there, dog lovers. Welcome back to Curious Corner, where we love all things furry and fun. Today we're talking about the essential skills every dog should know. Basic and advanced commands. Whether you're a first-time dog owner or a seasoned pro, this video is perfect for you. Note that as the video goes on, the commands become more and more challenging. However, the level of difficulty for each command will vary depending on the individual dog's personality, breed, and training history. Let's start with one of the easiest. One of the easiest commands you could teach your dog is give paw shake. Start with a treat in your hand and hold it out in front of your dog's nose. Say give paw or shake and gently lift your dog's paw. Give the treat as soon as their paw is lifted. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. Tour 2. After your dog gets the give paw shake command, you can move on to sit. This is also a great starting point as it's a simple command that can be easily mastered by most dogs. To teach your dog to sit, you could simply hold a treat in front of their nose and move it up and over their head. As they follow the treat, their hind end will naturally lower into a sitting position. As your dog's bottom touches the ground, say good sit and reward them with the treat. Repeat this process several times a day. Third, next we have stay. After your dog has mastered the sit command, you can start teaching them to stay. This is a bit more challenging, but once mastered, it can be incredibly useful. Start by having your dog sit, then say stay. Take a step back and hold up your hand with a closed fist, saying stay. If your dog stays, reward them with a treat. Gradually increase the distance and duration of the stay command. 4. Then we have stand. Start with your dog in a sitting position. Place one hand on your dog's chest and gently push upwards while saying stand. Give the treat when they are standing. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. 5. Another important command is come. This is a lifesaver in case your dog ever gets loose or runs off. To teach this command, simply call your dog's name and when they look at you, say come. As they start to move towards you, say good come and reward them with a treat. Repeat this process several times a day, gradually increasing the distance between you and your dog. 6. We equally have leave it is a crucial command that every dog should know. It teaches them to resist the urge to grab or eat something that they shouldn't, such as a dangerous or poisonous object. To teach this command, start by showing your dog a treat or toy that you have in your hand. When they try to grab it, say, leave it firmly and cover your hand with the other hand. When they stop trying to grab it, reward them with a treat from the other hand. Repeat this process several times, gradually increasing the difficulty until your dog can resist grabbing even when you have a highly desirable item in your hand. Remember to reward your dog each time they listen to the leave it command and to be patient and consistent in your training. 7. Moving on, we have heal. This is a command that's important when walking your dog. To teach your dog to heal, simply walk at a natural pace and use the command heal. If your dog starts to wander or pull ahead, stop and call them back to you. You can as well start by standing with your dog at your side and say heal. Take a step forward and reward your dog with a treat when they follow you. Gradually increase the distance you walk and the speed at which you walk, making sure to reward your dog each time they follow you correctly. Repeat this process until your dog is walking calmly by your side. 8 8 Down. Start with your dog in a standing position. Hold a treat in front of your dog's nose, then slowly move it towards the ground while saying down. When your dog's chest touches the ground, give them the treat. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. 9. Roll over. Start with your dog in a lying down position. Hold a treat near their nose and slowly move it over their head and towards their hind end. Say roll over and gently push their hind end towards the ground. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. To 10. High five, start with your dog in a standing position. Hold your hand up, palm facing out, and say high five. When your dog touches your hand with their paw, give them a treat. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. 11, fetch. Start with a toy and get your dog's attention. Toss the toy a short distance and say fetch. When your dog retrieves the toy, give them a treat. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. 12, drop it. Start with your dog holding a toy in their mouth. Say drop it, and when they release the toy, reward them with a treat. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the command. 13. Speak. Start with your dog in a relaxed position. Ask them to bark, for example by saying, what's that? When they bark, reward them with a treat. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the speak command. 14. Quiet. Start with your dog barking. Say quiet, and when they stop barking, reward them with a treat. Repeat the process several times until your dog understands the quiet command. These are just a few of the commands you could teach your dog. Actually, there are many other basic commands that you can teach your dog, such as turn, go, back, jump, 
go to place, spin, crawl, weave, go to mat, up, off, etc. The list is almost endless and it depends on what you want your dog to learn and what their abilities are. A little tip before you start training your dog. To explain a command to your dog, follow these steps. 1. Start with positive reinforcement training. Use treats, praise, and affection to reward your dog when they follow your commands correctly. 2. Choose a clear and simple word for each command and stick with it consistently. Avoid using different words for the same command as this can confuse your dog. 3. Use hand signals along with verbal commands. This can help reinforce the command and make it easier for your dog to understand. 4. Start training in a low distraction environment, then gradually add distractions as your dog gets better at following commands. 5. Repeat each command multiple times in each training session and gradually increase the duration of each training session as your dog gets better at following the commands. Remember, training takes time and patience, so be consistent and persistent and have fun. And there you have it, folks. Some essential commands every dog should know. With patience, consistency, and plenty of treats, you'll have a well-trained pup in no time. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more fun videos about all things furry and fabulous. Remember to stay safe and responsible. Till next time, be curious.